And yeah, this is a lot of nonsense. We're appreciating that Gordy Tupper has lost many, many pounds. He looked better today than he did before. Who's Gordy yeah. Tupper? Have you ever been visited by spaceships? Do you believe in them? <laughs> I don't know. You told me you rode in one once. I've been in one once. More than one? More than once. More than once. More than once. Tell me about once. Why? <laughs> well, I think the audience would like to know how you, don't how think how you talk different a different than everybody else. What makes you think I am? <laughs> oh, it's different. It's definitely different. Are you sure about that? Well, I can understand everybody else. And you can't. But you've got a mystery. You've got a mystery quality. And I think it had something to do with that spaceship. Oh, that was so long ago that I almost remember. You were, you, why a rabbit? Why, why did you travel in the body of a rabbit? They were trying to play some kind of a weird game with me. I thought, this is not, not even much trap. It's not a weird game. But the gaming shop and the gaming commissions are always going to get somewhere. <laughs> are you hiding out? I must be. Hey, come on now. Why can't you answer me? Though? Because I have nothing to say about that. I didn't have anything to do with it. You had nothing to do with it. I'm being curious. You were taken in. How were you taken up? Well, I did not talk that far out. <laughs> you won't talk I'm about still it. No, I didn't know you wouldn't talk about it before now. I, thought you'd I, I never did talk it. about it. It was somebody else's story. Talk about what? What the hell are you talking about? Well, what are you talking about? Well, What's going on here? When I first met him, he told me a story about how the books were opened in his hands. Yes. And you, you went in a, to, in a spaceship. He was taken up. He came over in a light wherein there was no night. He came out of a bar one day. And he was standing in a sparking lot. And his light came out of the sky and started at his feet. And he could... Uh, and, and it took him up. Maybe you could tell the story better. It took him up. In a spaceship sure in the form of a rabbit, he met the universal father Fourth of all men. And he was shown. Oh, I need to build a garden shed. Well, at this point, yeah. that's it. So, did you hear that? Yeah. are trying to build a shed. Okay, so when the books are opened in your hands. Okay. All right, and this is this is where we got to. You're up in the spaceship. No, no, I'm not coming to the spaceship. What, you, what would you call it? Stargate. Portal through. Yeah, I've been through the past. So what happened? What happened? I got blown away. The wind was too strong on me. I didn't come back. There was one out there about 28 hours. So why are, you, why are you back? Why are you still here? Well, because I haven't started out. I didn't even start there in the first place. Well, <laughs> I'm changing it. So where you was, can't where change me. I don't like it. Change. Okay. Well, well, well answer, answer why Lance was here while he was still here. So... <clears throat> The answer is a great song. Is the answer it is a great song. Everybody wants to know what's going on. And, and you got a right to know. I have the right to tell nobody nothing. <laughs> That's right. But the you guy, told me that. I have the right to know. I know, but the guy was yodeling in the Alps. I wasn't even over there. Then. All right, so what's happening now? I got his hat. You do? Yeah. You got his hat. I got a new hat every day. 50,000 of them a day. Every time, every time, every yeah, well, who are you? Who are you? I'm not even really interested anymore. I found out what I was talking about, though. You did? I certainly did, and I said everything I said because that's what I said. Mm -hmm. I didn't mean to be obnoxious like they do. Yeah, that's torture, baby. I don't want to go through this shit for nobody anymore. So what can you do? Do it differently? I that? don't know what I can do, but I can't do it for mammon's sake. For Christ's sake, you should know better. Yeah. Okay. So what do you Nobody's think about the, as it is. the new movie? The, the new movie. Listen, could you show people your, your cross here? That's a good one. I like that. Show, show people your cross there. Oh, the other one, on that nice chain. Well, I won't tell everybody the story. <laughs> Come on, it's You're a good one. You're going to be talking for no reason at all, driver. Look at him. He's utilized the, the cross. He's got a utility purpose for the cross. Yeah, one guy made a, uh, yeah. a car. It was actually made that one coffin and it was the cross. And we were going down the road one day and I saw him go by. Yeah. So what's going to happen now in the, in the world that we're living in? In the, in the, you know, all pretty well all at war. We're almost in Armageddon. What, well, what what's you, uh, I thought that was finished. <laughs> it's, you know, I wish you, I hope it's over. Yeah. But, well, but the signs around me as as are as that as it's falling down, that it's collapsing. You keep telling everybody how they're going to fail, not listening. they got to hear something else before they can repeat it. You know, if you got a parrot that sits on the winning numbers, he's your winning three stakes, 24 fires in the ninth, three times a day. But they're not, they're not classified winners, you know. Like I told you, there was something else taking place at the first time, and I didn't know anything about it, so I looked into it. 
And I found out they were sending most of the winning numbers to fucking deceased people, knowing their address and there wasn't anybody home. They kept the money for themselves. Fucking person. So we're not going that way? I hope not. I don't like working without you. Well, I didn't so, ask nobody to do anything for nothing anyway. So why, why do you think, what, what's, their pur- what's man's purpose? I think that's time. I think it's time to have that half time. You could have taken another story out and rearranged it any time you felt like you knew what the hell was really going on. What is going on? Very little, but right now they're talking about somebody else. I'm glad of that. Have <laughs> <laughs> you ever had people talk about you all the time? I tell you, it's not. You got 700,000 people out there trying to figure out what happened after you got back. You weren't even there in the first place. So how do we get here? Uh, I think you have to walk in the farmer's field, walk in some chips. I don't know. Maybe you got to <laughs> take the manure pile out. It's hard to know what to do. When it heats up... It is hard to know what to do. In the olden times, you know, yeah. we used to take the wood caddies, you know, the chips, the buffalo chips, and you know, follow the river up. They just cook dinner with that. Yeah, I heard they're finding they're taking those beetles from there. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. They're taking the cow dung for beetles. All kinds of things. All kinds. No, dung beetles do that because the dung beetles. They roll up the pit and all. So, so we're not going to get any straight answers out of you today. We're going to have to get straw back to the straw man. This is the tin man again. Yeah, back in the fairy tale. Look how long it took me to get out of the fairy tale to start with. Hey, hey, where are we from? We went Ireland, Dublin, and. England is not England. It doesn't have to have. What do you, what do you think is going to happen to the world, the future a world? Num- a number of things will repeat themselves. A few won't make it. What do you think the answer is for the future? There's no answer. Is there a question of the future? Always questioning the answer. There's no answer. What? The request is denied internally because of internal chatter on chat line. Do not think that Tom Sung, NG, he, and Sun Sam Su. We're talking about Fohan Matt and Fat Cat and everybody else out there saying it's Ninny, here's a Winnie. <laughs> and it was Winnie the Pooh, and it was Winnie the Pooh, right? <laughs> no, Winnie the Pooh. Um, come on, every Pooh Bear knows. You can't get Charlie Brown to sit down on the couch and say, you know, he's wrong. What yeah. would you do about the sewage problem in Victoria? Were they pumping sewage into the ocean? 100 uh, million liters a day. Oh, do I have to repeat that sickness for God's sake? Is, it, <laughs> is there an answer for that? There might be if they take uh, considered out value and come back to inside space. But they're building arenas well, instead yeah, for the gladiators. Do that, yes. <laughs> they like fighting over the fucking like, fact that they overpriced everything and get the money back later, maybe. It's, it's too, too it's twisted, grant. though. It's too no, twisted. It we, we do have to straighten it up. It was yeah. given to me as a grant. Now they expect everybody else to be paid for their grant to be here. They're going to expect it. I don't know what I'm saying. Well, I'm just trying to figure out what are what are we doing? Here? Like what, what's going I on? have just decided that they're going to pay for everything that they got to do, and they're going to make sure I don't have to go for it again before they go and step into it. They're going to burn the bridges. I, I don't know if anybody can keep up. I think it's to. hard. Keep up with what? What's going on? <laughs> as much as you can. Just, who are you? I'm not even wanting to know. <laughs> what, what what are you here for? Here's a and lousy opinion. You're here for that? Apparently. Nobody believed a word I said so far until now. Because they know death walked by you didn't touch it. <laughs> you're unfortunate. You, you, you think that guy's still looking for something? Yeah. We're hell in the wrong spot. Hey, listen, I mean, there's no such thing as a son of perdition. Yeah, no. Do you think Jesus is coming back? Thomas Olbert. Go ahead. Shh. He's not coming back. They don't look like that. He won't, he, he'll wait for uh, Walter. Literal prophecy. Well, Edgar Cayce, them guys? No. Oh, no biblical prophecy. Biblicals don't prophesy. The philosophers, they don't prophesy. Nothing. Each personality in the local value of the local universe displayed with random house selections and all those people are authors and kudos to the author of all those who still have power to get away the kids. Hmm. There's lots of different flower children. Well, yeah, well they're almost gone now. They've become lawyers and real estate agents. No, now they're too good for it. Judges. They're too good for everybody. Yeah, so what's the revolution today? Hmm? Where are we evolving to? Stop. When you have to relieve yourself before you walk into a wall again. Empty your, empty your vessel. I don't even want to throw the passengers around. They're fucking dangerous. They all go to one side of the ship and the ship pulls over and they all drawn and my ball. <laughs> <laughs> So, well, 
So, uh, is that it? No, 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 no. It's ongoing. It's ongoing. It's you just got to keep working it out. Work it out. What to do? Where, where are we going? How are we going? How, how are we? Uh, how are we really doing? And figuring it out, talking about it. So is this a close out? Are you closing out now? Yeah. Okay. okay. So this is uh, David and Jonathan, and uh, he's in uh, Bastards. So uh, we're making the movie. End up with a song, please. Uh, Again with the hymn, maybe something that would be nice. That's a different one. I can't, I can't sing that hymn that way. Right now I'm backing off here. Okay. On yeah. <laughs> Good. So, uh, so that's it. That's it. This is it. We're, this is the move. Move out of Coventry. And uh, back and forth now. Thanks a lot. So uh, <coughs> we're off to the garden, and uh, this is uh, David and uh, Jonathan and uh, Mr. Red, and uh, we're at Coventry Castle, Victoria, British Columbia. And uh, life uh, has been run by uh, bastards up until uh, just recently. So uh, stay tuned, and uh, she'll get back here. Oh, it's Coventry, eh? <clears throat>